Alex Morgan is back! Now hit me with some USA. Good news! The USA beat Colombia 2-0 in the Women's World Cup and has a date with China in the quarterfinals. Bad news, thanks to some BS yellow cards, they'll be without Lauren Holiday and their best player, Megan Rapino. Let them play! Good news, Alex Morgan looks like she's back to her old self, scoring the game-winning goal and setting up a PK with a terrific run. Bad news, that run was set up by a great pass from Megan Rapino, who, again, won't play against China. Good news, China's not really the same soccer power they were in 1999 when they faced the USA in the final. However, bad news, they are very young, no player is older than 26, and well organized, and the US has failed to maintain possession in the midfield. Good news though, the US defense is awesome, they haven't given up a goal in the last three games. Bad news, this is probably going to be a 1-0 or 0-0 game. But good news, if this is a nil game after 120 minutes, US has Hope Solo, the best goalkeeper in the world. But bad news, the Chinese goalkeeper Wang Fei is also really good. But good Good news, the US simply has better players than China and the deepest roster at the Women's World Cup. However, bad news, Coach Jill Ellis seems to have no idea how to put together a starting 11 with any kind of specific strategy. But good news, the game is Friday night, so you can apply as much booze to this game as you need to. It's just going to be this and this all night for me. Cheers! <laughs>